Hey guys, welcome to today's video. So we're you are going to be doing a full day wear test of the new Sephora collection, Sephora Soft Matte Easy. So I'm probably gonna grab something to eat when I get to work, so I might have to apply this at work. So if I do have to apply it, I might just like explain it later on, what happened, all that stuff about at eight type thing. It depends on the food I'm eating, and it depends if I want to grab some meat before I start work. So, the Sephora collection is new to Sephora, it's a Sephora, part of the Sephora collection. Soft, easy, liquid lip. It's a matte. It is $20. It is vegan, liquid formula long wearing. Let's see about that. Um, a liquid lipstick with medium billable high impact matte coverage that lasts all day. We'll see if I can wear this all day at work before I, when I do, maybe eat breakfast. Because I haven't ate breakfast yet. It's long wearing, it's vegan, it's liquid. They have a bunch of different colors here, like 14 shades. I picked up the shade number four. We are going to line my lips with the Rare Beauty in the shade. You know, Lively. This is one of my favorite colors. I like for line art, pretty nude-ish. Even with this color, I can just put some gloss on top and go. I'll be happy with it. I'll close that up. So we're going to go in with the uh, shade here, pretty neutral color, yeah. That's the doe foot applicator. I put, okay, hang on, I need to sneeze. There's some of these matte formulas I have tried and I don't care for that type of thing because they felt dry and crusty on the lips. Mainly in Super Stay line is one of them. I don't really have any of that here left because I declare all that. The only thing I actually really like from the Super Stay line from Maybelline is their ink crayon. Anything else I tried from Super Stay was either that it really dry and crusty on my lips because all my liquid lipsticks are either here or with the glasses and the oils. And then right here. So I got a few things from the Sephora collection here. Well, I was like the drugstore stuff. Mix. Essence. So let's look, get this on and seeing how it works. Because I also try the Hello Slugs, Juice, the Shakers. I'll post that video up above in the cards as well. That one for sure because I ended up returning that product. I did what followed and it, like, it was not that great. Okay, I like the color. I like this color on me for sure. So a neutral color, I'm like, like, like. To be fair, I own a lot in this color-ish. I own a few reds, but most of them are like in this pinky, brown, like the Huda. They both look the same, but different shades. Oh my 
uh, vials. So let's see how well this goes. It is matte. It looks pretty nice. I got coffee here. There is some transfer from my probably inner lip or in here. I don't know. I'm gonna get finished, get ready for work, and I will see you when I get home from work. I'm gonna throw this in my pocket with me. I might have to apply this at work if I have McDonald's for breakfast or some sort of McMuffin for breakfast. So because I'm getting hungry, so I'll check in with you guys when I get home from work. Hey guys, welcome back. So I am I'm gonna give my final thoughts of the Sephora Collection Soft Matte Liquid Lip. It was this shade four, laid back, matte. I really enjoy this color for sure. I'll definitely be wearing this color a lot more than I normally do. But if my nice is long wear, am I saying is it long wear? No. I have breakfast because I I kind of knew what I was planning on eating for breakfast when I got to work. It is kind of on the greasy side, so therefore um. I kind of added another coat, and I thought you know it's a good fair chance. But then by the time I was I was drink, as I was drinking my coffee, drinking my water, my own, a wall of water bottle, which I highly recommend. The water bottles of 32 ounces so last me all day at work. I refill it a few times throughout the day. Today not so much. It keeps my water cold all day, which I really like. And then it's put back on the book. Sorry, I'm getting tired. So, with a smooth lock with liquid lip, you, if you eat some food that is generally very like, cheesy, a little bit greasy type thing, or drinking like water and drinking your coffee throughout the day, keeping it hydrated, you're definitely gonna have to repeat the coats throughout the day for sure. I will definitely continue to wear this. It's definitely not so it's climbing as long wear. My lips generally do feel really dried out after a really like long wear liquid lip, which surprisingly it is not doing that. Isn't my lips still feel dry whatsoever? Which is a whim because some mats feel like it makes it feels like <laughs> makes it feel like your um ow. Make your lips feel very dry at the end of the day, so that's like also a counteractive of like, okay, I could take a long wear, but then my lips feel very dry out. That's what I find with the super stay line from Maybelline. Like, if, it, if it's uh, dried my lips out and it flakes off, I'm like, nope, I don't want you because you are not going to be any good. Bye bye. That is what happens a lot. That's why I have a hard time finding a good long wear liquid lip to last me all day. Oh, my legs are edge. Sorry, my legs. That's why I have one or two good ones. Like the Give line is pretty long wear. Last me all day. Again, I want to buy more colors this line. I don't know if she has much more colors. From that line, like I like, I tend to see to wear this color more than a red. Because if I am going to wear a red lippy, my eyes are going to go with the lip. Like my lips are going to be the bold color of the day, and my eyes are going to be laid back type thing. That's why I have a hard time like trying to. So I don't wear lip red lip very often because I have to like okay this is what we're doing today and I have to really concentrate putting on like some of these are like ones like this I can pop it on out the door I go red lip you have to like concentrate and make sure it's good nothing is make you going out the lip line type look because I don't like that look so that's why I have a have a tendency to lean towards the miles. Or nudes. Or just simply a gloss. Or a bullet too, depending on the mood I'm in. That too, or oil. So yeah. If you're curious about the uh, 
matte liquid lip over the uh, um, which one is this one? The cream stain, cream lip stain. I like these ones better than these ones, type thing. But these ones, they have more color to choose from. If you're looking for a particular color, this color, they don't have very many colors yet. From the line, it's a fairly new line type thing. Like, I like a lot from the collection, Sephora collection line in general. Yeah, like I say, there's no, I haven't have experienced anything from that really that line not very often I don't like. They reformulated some of this stuff actually turned out a really a lot better. So I'm a huge fan of the collection line. Like, I like their makeup brushes. I like their setting spray currently. This is the second one. They're more pops if you're looking for a dupe of your iconic favorite uh, Tati Beauty Blender Puff. Beauty Bundable Puff. I recommend the Sephora collection. Like, oh, I think I got with one more backup left. I'm like, I want to buy some more, but they haven't been in stock for a lot of minute. So, yeah, I haven't found anything that too much I really don't like on the line yet that I have tried for the makeup ish. There's a few things I don't care for that a lot. Um, but it's saying it's sequin for their uh, compact eye singles. Sequins to me are more of a matte with a glittery finish. These are too glittery, they're almost like a glitter. You know, you know. So yeah, I'm gonna sign off because I'm getting very tired. I post two videos on twice a week on Wednesdays and Fridays at Tinia PST. Don't subscribe, don't ring a bell, and I hopefully I see you guys in the next one. Okay.